let's talk about this hairstyle, right? Okay, so my hair was already cut short, as you guys know. Um, and I started to grow it back because I had gotten some braids and the braids slipped out because my hair was too short, right? So I wanted to grow it back. I wanted my hair to grow back long, right? So I have been wearing this um, black and blonde, platinum blonde, black and platinum blonde wig. And I like the blonde, surprisingly. If it wasn't for my husband, I would've never tried that particular color of blonde. I wanted like a honey blonde, but they didn't have it in the braids. And so I went ahead and tried the platinum blonde because he said he thought it would look good. So I ended up liking it and he loved it. So I got like a couple of wigs in that shade. I've only been wearing one wig. I haven't worn another one yet. Um, so I was like, okay, well let me get my hair um, dyed this color, it's summertime. So let me get some summer hair. I will probably never do this again. Um, you know, I have the dye all the way down to the root, but I, the look that I'm going for is to have black root with the blonde on the top. So I told her, go ahead and take the dye, the blonde, all the way to the root because I will probably never do this again. So let's just do it for this, you know, first time around, get over with because it's summer and it's just hair. My hair is already short. If I don't like it, I just cut it off and um, I'll be fine. I don't want to wait until my hair gets long and then experiment something with something like that. So I said, okay, let's go ahead and cut it. And not only that, um, well, dye it. So she dyed it for me and um, I'm gonna show you guys all of that. She dyed it for me and I didn't get my hair cut. She didn't cut it or anything for me. So I left and called her back the next day because I was just like, I didn't like it without having some kind of um, shape to it because the only shape I had in there was something I had did myself like months and months ago. I never cut hair before and um, I didn't know what the heck I was doing, but I made it really, really low so it was okay, it looked cute. Until it grew out and you saw how uneven it was, like on the sides, I had more hair here than I did up there. It was just whack. Uh, so the next day I called her, I said, I, no, that day I called her, I said, girl, can I make an appointment come back to you tomorrow? And she offered it as a courtesy because she understood that you had, I had to go home and see how it worked and everything. So um, she got me in the next morning and then I so she, I could work with this, but no. So it's freshly washed, no product except for some hair lotion. <laughs> how do you want me to get my hair shaped? Like a star or something. A star? Yeah, a star heart. So she gave me this cut and my husband and I decided on the mohawk look because we both really, really love the mohawk. So I had all this hair in the back and so as you can see the back of my hair, it's lighter than the rest of my hair because she started back here with the dye. So obviously this hair was dyed longer than the rest. And so, um, you know, she's just like, well, you sit out in the sun a lot, so it's going to get lighter. Because I'm always out in the sun. I'm a sunflower, okay? <laughs> my favorite flower, but I'm always out in the sun. So this stuff is going to get lighter. So if that's the objective, that's the goal, is for it to be like a platinum color. But however, I love the orange copper look. Um, so this is, this is just fine for me. The fact that the top of my hair did not, um, get as light as the rest of my hair. And then with blonde, she did explain to me that you could place any color on top of blonde, whether it's purple, black, red, burgundy, whatever you want. So, um, so yeah, so I, there are options here, you know, so I'm not locked in. And like I said, my hair is already short. I don't really mind starting over with my hair because it's natural and I love the natural look and it just grows so fast. And um, so I'm enjoying the experimentation of it all, you guys. You only live life one time. Don't be put in a box. I tell my daughters all the time. Um, don't let people put you in a box. Explore, um, you know, have fun with life, you know, and hair is our glory, but hair does grow back, okay? So anywho, um, I just wanted to give a quick update on this. Um, if you wanna know the color that she used, I will find out, just drop a comment below and let me know if that's something you guys even care to know about. Um, and then I'll find out from her what she put in there. Um, yeah, so follow my journey here because I am letting my hair grow back. The, like I said before, the objective is for my hair to grow long because I miss my ponytails and all the buns and stuff and my afro. I want a big afro. Uh, that's my favorite hairstyle. The afro and the wash and go like tie for me. Um, so 
Anyways, the goal is to grow my hair as long as I want it to, but to have like the black root and all of that and this color on top. So, um, so yeah. So let me go know what you guys think. It is a shocker. It's kind of weird to see myself <laughs> looking like this and my baby hair. It's hard to even see the baby hair because it's all blonde and it's weird because I never thought that um, blonde hair would look good on me, but I'm noticing that people, as I pay attention, people who have, I think blonde looks good on pretty much anybody, but people who have a darker skin tone, because of the contrast there, it's, uh, I think it's beautiful. I think the color is really pretty. So, so I also had gray in my hair, and so I know gray does not necessarily take to dye the same way as the rest of your hair. And sometimes you have to manipulate it a little longer than you do the rest of your hair. Um, however, mine tend, tended to do just fine. Um, so we didn't have any issues there. So right now I have Curls Unleashed in my hair. This is the product. Curls Unleashed Shea Butter and Honey Curl Defining Cream. And I love, oh my God. <laughs> I don't know what they got in here. I mean, I can read the direction in degrees, but that's what it is. I've had this for over a year, and um, I love the way it performs. At least right now, if you want a fluffy, less defined look, um, this is good. Because I usually like to use gel for a more defined look, but this is working out just fine for me. I just had to massage it into my hair really, really good because I applied it to wet hair and um, I had like cream dripping down in water streams on the side of my hair. So, um, but yeah, I love this stuff. Um, if you guys would like to see me do a, uh, a live wash and go, just let me know. But yeah, um, so if you wanna follow my new hair journey, my, I, I don't know if I wanna call this a third, fourth, fifth big chop. This would be number four, I think. Um, kind of a four big chop. So, uh, but in the in the design of a, a mohawk, though. Um, so yeah, four big chop and blonde hair on dark skin. <laughs> so uh, anyway, you guys, uh, let me know if you have any questions. Not going to be using anything in particular to grow my hair. I just, let me tell you, I wash my hair every day. Yes, I do. And if not every day, every other day, but for the most part, I wash my hair every day and I use um, all natural um, products on my hair to wash my hair with. Um, and not that I won't ever use anything else, but right now that's what I've been using for the past two, two and a half years. Um, so, but yes, yeah, so I wash my hair every day. My Your hair loves water. Um, I moisturize my hair, has a conditioner in it and all that good stuff. I'm not doing anything special um, for this hair growth journey of mine. So if you guys want to just follow it, I'm not taking any extra vitamins. I'm just taking, um, you know, my regular vitamins, multivitamin, and, and that's it. Not doing anything special. Just going to let it grow, see how fast it grows and what it does with this color. And if that's something you're interested in, hit that subscribe button, that like button, drop a comment, question, concern, hello, and I will see you guys in the next video.